Okay, hey guys, it's Fireports11 here with a new tutorial for iTrackie.com. Uh, yeah. Okay, so this is a tutorial on jailbreaking. Yes, I have made a tutorial on jailbreaking before, but this is a new one. This is Spirit Jailbreak, as in the jailbreak um, untethers all forms of iPod Touch and iPhone. Yes, it works for 3.1.3. And for the 3G and model for the iPod Touch and 3D or in 3GS models for iPhone, they are untethered, which means you can shut them off without um, having to plug it back into your computer. My iTouch is um, a 3G. Uh, I'll show you proof for that later, just if you don't believe me. Oh, which means if I shut it off right now, it will turn on without me doing anything. So, watch. Okay. Just power it off. And shut it on. I'll shut off. I can just hit the power button. Sorry about that. And... Boom, boom, boom. There it is. It will load up. It might take a little while because Apple, I don't know, it just takes a while to load up in general. But it will eventually load up. So, the thing about this, it is untethered. It is 3.1.3. There is no difference between it, um, this jailbreak and Black Rain. They're actually very similar. Um, and see, it's turned on. It works, it, and if see everything works themes as you can tell. This is not the normal theme. Um. Yeah. So here's how you're gonna do it. Let's go back onto my computer. Okay. So first of all, you're gonna want to download the Spirit Jailbreak program from SpiritJB.com. Okay, once you're there, it's going to look like this. It's actually really plain. Donate if you actually want to. It's not necessary. You don't need to, but I recommend it. I haven't. Um, but whatever. Choose your operating system. I have a Windows. I have a Windows, so I downloaded it. I don't I already have it downloaded. Okay, now you go find it in the file. It will look like this. Um, let me go see if I can find it. Uh, sorry. Um, it looks like this, a circle with a circle on the Oh yeah, so when you open it up, it's going to look somewhat like black rain, just a little less detailed. Holy crap, it's in the corner. Just like, okay. It will, it'll say ready, um, what you have, iPhone or iPod Touch, uh, the generation and the, mo or in the firmware. Now what you do is, it's really simple, you just hit jailbreak. After you hit jailbreak, it will start running and it will eventually say this. And if it doesn't work, I'm sorry, this thing has been annoying me all day with working and not working. It will say jailbreak successful. And then I will get back onto the actual webcam to show you how to do it. Now that it is loading up, you see that it will come to this screen. And once that it's at this screen, it will work. This means it's working, jailbreaking, it's jailbreaking, and it will eventually work. Um, there's a bar in the middle that'll tell you how much process it's done. And with that done, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I'm sorry, it's not very in-depth. Uh, there might be one error you will have. It's like a five, I, I don't even care how to say it. But what you do, you ch I'll have it somewhere in the description on how to fix it. You get the error. I only think it I only it only happens to Windows. Sorry for the stutter. And so it look here, it's actually done. So don't worry if you're on a Mac about this uh, about the error. If you do have an error on the Mac, just please uh, comment below, and I will get right to you. Okay, bye.